What's up guys? Welcome to the channel. This video, super excited for it. We are going to share what's in the box. Um, I got this maybe a week or two ago and I've been really excited to put this video together. Um, so without further ado, let's get into it. So, all right, we are headed out. We are headed out and about. We got some stuff to pick up from the store before we unveil what's in the box. So let's go and get it. And uh, here we go. It is. It's hot as a tick today. This guy just completely cut me off. That's okay. You know, today's just a good day. Like, low. Off work today, stress free. We're just chilling, getting stuff done, being productive. How can you hate that? All right, we made it to the store. Um, I'm debating on telling y'all what it is because if I do, I might give it away. Um, so I don't think I'm gonna tell y'all. I think I'm gonna wait. But uh, here we go. This is cool. So dang excited about this thing. Spent some money on it. Was not anticipating it to be so expensive. It also says it's fragile, so I'm gonna walk really slow. Oh, well, that gives it away. All right, we're packed up in the car. I'm about to run a couple other errands, pick up some more things we need, and then we'll go home and let y'all know what's in the box, baby. Yeah. Let's do it, baby, come on. The way I look at it is, you know, you're gonna spend money you're gonna buy things. They might not. They might not all be cheap. They might not all be, you know, clearance. But sometimes you're gonna have to spend some money to do things that you like, and um, that's what my thought process is for this. So I spent the day today going all over the place buying things. I still needed to pick up a couple of items before I was ready to unveil what's in the box. Um, if you can guess what I got from Michaels from the video a little bit earlier, I got a couple things. They were a little bit more expensive than I was anticipating, but that's all part of the process. You know, when you're when you're doing something creative, when you're doing something. Um, that you haven't done before. Um, sometimes it adds up, but that's that's okay. I'm, to, I'm totally okay with that. Let's see first what I bought from Michaels and then see if you guys can guess what's in the box. And then I'm gonna tell you guys what I'm about to do with this thing in the box. But like I said, I got some other things from Michaels as well and I'm gonna show you guys what I got. So I got the six pack of Mars Lumograph Black. Not sure if I'm saying that correctly. Um, these are just six different shades of, of charcoal pencils. I got a graphite set as well, including some pencils, um, some hard compo compressed charcoal, a kneaded eraser, and a sharpener, which is gonna come in clutch. I got a 12 pack of different shades of drawing pencils, which is gonna be huge. I got two packs of compressed charcoal. These are, are gonna be my workhorses. And last but not least, I got a traditional gum eraser and some blenders, some blending stumps, which are really good for blending in um, whites and lights and, and all things like that. So, 
I have all these things and now you probably have a good idea as to why you know I have all these things what's in the box I have an easel I have all these artistic items charcoal erasers blenders etc oh I forgot I also have this really cool charcoal set. Um, never used it. But it's basically the same thing as uh, some of these, just a little bit more volume in here. Um, so yeah, so these are all the things I have. Let's get into what's in the box right now. Thanks for waiting, being patient. Let's do it. All right, the grand finale. Here we go. If you guessed um, the grand finale, here we go, the big reveal. If you guessed a canvas, you would be right. I got two custom large canvases. Um, that's, what this big, that's what this big box is for. I got these from a really cool website. I'll, I'll link it in the description. Um, it was cheap. It was buy one get one free for these huge these huge things. I'm really excited for it um, So yeah, I was sitting in my bed the one day and I was thinking to myself wow my room could definitely use some work on the walls It's empty Maybe you know some painting some shelves, something like that I could put on and I went online and I was I was looking up stuff looking at things, looking at different paintings, things that interest me and things that caught my eye. Um, and I found some things, maybe, you know, here or there, different abstract paintings and things like that that I thought were cool looking or maybe something like that, but nothing, nothing really stuck out in a way that was really meaningful to me. And that's, that's when I got to thinking, you know, maybe I can make my own artwork, my own piece of art and put it on my wall and really have it something that, you know, means something to me, A, and B, um, is something that I make with my own hands, which I, I definitely um, put a lot of value in. So that's what I did. I ordered these canvases, I got a bunch of charcoal, and I got this easel, and we're gonna make some artwork, and I'm really excited for it. I think I've only worked with charcoal once in art class in high school, so it's been a while, I'm gonna have to do some, I'm gonna have to relearn it a little bit. Um, but I think it's really cool. I think it's a, an interesting way to express yourself. So I'm looking forward to, to putting some, some cool artwork on here. This video is part one of the series. I'm going to do um, behind the scenes of actually making everything on here. Uh, which is going to include the inspiration for what I'm going to put on here because I really don't know at this point. Um, and then a final three, part three to the series will be the final product, um, putting it on my wall and, and really putting the finishing touches on it. Um, this is a big thing. This thing is, this canvas is huge. So it might take me a while to do. Um, so I don't know when the part two is going to be out, but stay tuned for that. Hit that like and subscribe button for all the updates. Make sure you don't miss it. And uh, thank you guys for tuning into this video. Really excited to see what comes out of it. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.